How's it going guys? Uh, right now we're driving to Red Feathers Lake, uh, which is where the Shambhala Center is located at. And uh, I'm pretty excited because this is actually my favorite place in Colorado. Uh, this center is just incredible, great energy. We're going to do a little bit of meditation there and I'm going to show you around the area including the mountains and uh, the beautiful uh, beautiful temple. So uh, I'm excited, I hope you're excited. here when it snowed so the uh, kind of the roads or the the path is a little bit uh, lost so we're gonna try to find the path let's see if we can find it but I'm excited I'm really really excited to uh, to make it to the stupa and do some meditation and show you um, a little bit of the, the temple I mean it's one of the most famous um, um, those stupas and spiritual centers in, in the U.S. And as you'll see as we get up there, if there's a place for sitting meditation, there's a place for walking meditation. So it is really cool in that way. One of the things that I do want to mention as, uh, as I'm recording this, just the importance of having a daily ritual. Whether you do it once a day or twice a day, it's important to really have a healthy mental routine that helps you know not only to keep your um, keep a positive mindset but also uh, to keep you know to really allow to better and better control your mind uh, you know I talk to a lot of people and it seems to be one of the most common things whether you're successful or you're trying to be successful in life in relationships or anything it's amazing how being out of control with your mind can lend itself to, to some really uh, low points in terms of mood, being in a negative mindset, or even just having a negative life in general. So, actually, I think we went too far. <laughs> yeah, so we went a little too far. Brought my mom here today. She's over here in the back. <laughs> my lead tour guide. <laughs> she looks like a snow ninja. Look at this, like a ninja of the nieve. Oh my god, check this out. This is the beginning of the trail to the stupa. It's right in the background there. It's gonna be a really good time over there. At the actual temple, you can actually set your intentions by writing down whatever wishes you have for yourself, for your life, or for others, and put them in this bin. You're stored in the temple. The Shambhala Mountain Center was founded in 1971. It is high in the Colorado Rockies in a serene 600 acre valley surrounded by rocky peaks, pine, and aspen forests. It's really an awesome place to spend a day hiking or even a weekend or a week on a retreat. 